Hi, this is Akash and I'm here to make things simple for you. Okay, so this is a very tricky video. By tricky video, I mean that the video is full of tricks for you. So you are going to enjoy this video. So please do watch the video till the very end and you are going to learn a lot of tricks regarding how to do the odd one out regarding number classification. Okay, so let's get started. So the first step regarding the number classification based odd one out is numbers can be classified as prime, composite, square, cube and binary. So what are prime numbers? We know that what are prime numbers? Number that is being divided by itself or by one. What are composite numbers? Those numbers which are not prime, these are composite. And we know what are the squares and cubes of the numbers. I strongly recommend you to memorize the squares and cubes of numbers up to 30. Okay. And what are binary numbers? 0, 1. Okay. So let's get started. So the first question is find the odd 1 out 17, 27, 37, 47. So this looks some sort of prime number uh, combination because 17 is a prime number. We know that. Okay. Now these are actually not very large numbers. Suppose in the exam you get very large numbers. How to know whether it is prime or not? It can get quite cumbersome for you. Okay. So the trick for you to find out any number whether it is prime or not. Every prime number greater than 3 can be written as 6k plus 1 or 6k minus 1. Where k is an integer. So here is the trick for you. Every prime number greater than 3 can be written as 6k plus 1 or 6k minus 1 where k is an integer. So if you look at for 17, it is 6k minus 1, 6 into 3 minus 1. Then for 37, it is 6k plus 1, 6 into 6 plus 1. Then for 47, it is 6k minus 1. So every prime number is either 6k plus 1 or 6k minus 1. While 27 doesn't fit in 6k plus 1 or 6k minus 1. So it is not prime. So here's the trick for you. 27 is the odd one out. I hope you like the trick. Please do memorize it or write it down somewhere. Okay. So, next uh, question is find the odd one out. The options are 441, 289, 361, 343. So, we need to find out what is the odd one out here. Right. So, 441 is actually square of 21. 289 square of 70. Nine, uh, 361 is the square of 19 while 343 is the cube of 7 as I have already said in this video you need to memorize the squares and cubes of all the integers from 1 to 30 okay this is highly recommended for you okay for any examination it is highly recommended for you so fourth option 343 is the odd one out because it is not the square it is a cube okay Next we have find the odd one out 1011 So in case you get such question find the odd one out and the number is actually binary. So in that case what you do you convert that to decimal. In order to get a better understanding of binary to decimal do watch our videos on number system. It is there in the playlist. Okay, You can watch the playlist on number system. But here we have a shortcut for you. So that's the good news. Okay. So let us see the shortcut. The trick. You just write down 1, 2, 4, 8, 16 like that. Okay. So then we have the number suppose 1, 0, 1, 1. So you write it down from right to left. 1, 1, 0, 1. Okay. So whatever, uh, uh, whenever there is a 1, whatever is there at the top, you just add those things like it is now 1011, 1 comes below 8, okay, then another one comes below 2, then another one comes below 1. So you just add those 8 plus 2 plus 1, so 11 comes. That's the shortcut, I hope you like that, okay. You can do it for any binary number, okay. So ne uh, next we see, next number from right to left, if we write, it becomes 1101, so in that case, 8 plus 4 plus 1, it is 30. Similarly, for next, 1111, one, 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 it is 8 plus 4 plus 2 plus 1, 
15. Next is 1 triple 0 1. So what does that become? It becomes 16 plus 1. That is 70. Okay. So uh, that's the technique of doing it. So if you see the rest of the numbers are actually prime 11, 13 and 17 except what 15. Okay. 15 is not a prime number. So the answer is the third option. So that's the odd one out. I hope you have enjoyed the video and uh, regarding all those tricks and all. I hope you have enjoyed them. And those tricks are universally accepted actually. That works everywhere. I hope you find the video valuable. So please do hit the like button and do subscribe the channel. In order to get more free pra uh, practice exercises, do join our telegram channel. Link for which is given right there below. And please do visit teachmycourse.com where you would find a lot of free practice exercises for you. I wish you happy learning and stay tuned.